Hello, Dini Judd here again, and we are still on the theme of content. So let's look at how I repurposed my blog post last week. Uh -uh. Where are I? Sorry, I'm ill prepared here. So this was my blog post, Marketing for Online Tutors. Um, and if you remember, what I was saying was, let's make that content work for us. Let's eke it out as much as possible. So you might prefer to do a YouTube video um, teaching somebody how to do a certain part of the exam, uh, answer a question, prepare an essay, whatever it is you teach online or want to teach online. Um, think of that one main piece of, com uh, of content and then you want to slice and dice it. Okay, so this was the the blog post and in it I talked about the Trello board using a Trello board that I showed you last week, this video here, and then I made a video of that. I've since put that onto YouTube um, and then I also linked to a, a free calendar called Run Ed that you get from a company called CoSchedule. Now you'll see that these are the links. Why have I linked to Trello and to CoSchedule? Well, because for purposes of search engine optimization, I want my website to be found. And a great way of doing that is that Google likes is when it crawls your site, it likes to see that you are sharing and giving. You're not just sort of hogging things all to yourself. You're sharing good information and you're sending people to other places. So. Think about that when you're writing a blog post. So you'll see there, co-schedule, my Facebook group is my main purpose. I want people to join my Facebook group and then Trello. So I've got these things. Now, what I've done then with this one blog post is I showed you this before and I organized it so that I had all my images on my all prepared already on Facebook okay and then what I did was I came over to Facebook and that's my personal page we've got so many groups here teachers lounge let's see what I did I just close that down. Uh, da, 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 da. So I made, how do you organize your week? Um, mm, mm, mm. I did the, the co-schedule, a diary, the, the calendar, the giveaways that they do. I made a post about that. I've already got the blog post and I flung in a favourite podcast ones because which ones are helpful to people creating content and I made a, a post about Trello boards. So can you see that from that one and then I went over to LinkedIn I did more, I did more, I did more or I can't see where I've posted it but I posted that whole, was it there? That's an article I did Sorry, um, I made a post anyway about that and I could have done much more. I should have done much more. I should have done um, a Instagram posts. I should have done Twitter, a Twitter posts, all of that. But there are only so many hours in the day and I'm feeling quite pleased with myself that I've done LinkedIn and Facebook to quite a good effect, I think, in terms of I've made that one blog post and squeezed it dry and a uh, posted the video as well on YouTube. So this week's blog post is just about to come out and a uh, I will do the same again with that. Any questions let me know. Okay speak to you soon.